Hello, I'm Cara DeFalco. New Jersey will pay almost $53 million to 119 families who lost loved ones in state-run veterans' homes during the pandemic. The Edison and Paramus facilities are also being investigated by the state's attorney general's office. The State Department of Education did not attend the Senate Education Committee's hearing last week. Senators wanted to know from the department on staffing shortages, closures, and the state's handling of the pandemic within the school system.